Natural gas prices are moving lower after an unsuccessful attempt to settle above $9.60. Today, EIA released its weekly natural gas storage report, which indicated that working gas in storage increased by 18 billion cubic feet from the previous week, compared to the analyst consensus of 34 billion cubic feet. Natural gas markets rallied after the release of the report, but faced strong resistance near $9.65 due to profit-taking and pulled back below the $9 level. The volatile reversal to the downside took place even though daily output fell and hotter than normal weather continued on the West Coast. Some of the selling was fueled by technical indicators signaling overbought conditions. Fundamental traders were also surprised by the strength in the market due to potentially bearish factors such as the ongoing Freeport outage, the upcoming hurricane season and rising production. From a big-picture point of view, the challenging situation in Europe continues to provide support to natural gas markets around the world. Germany is trying to secure LNG supplies, but the country's energy regulator believes that Germany will miss its November target for gas storage levels. In the U.S. natural gas markets, the upside trend stays strong. In case natural gas manages to stay above the $9 level, it will have a good chance to get above the resistance at $9.70 after a period of consolidation. Natural gas futures linked to TTF, Europe's wholesale gas price, were trading around the €240 Euro per megawatt hour mark, not far from an all-time high of €300 Euros hit in March in the aftermath of Russia's invasion of Ukraine, supported by a combination of tight supplies and soaring demand for power generation amid persistent heat waves across Europe. A historic drought triggered by an arid summer that set heat records across Europe threatens to halt energy shipments along the Rhine River, exacerbating concerns about further supply disruptions. On top of that, Russia's Gazprom has reduced flows through the Nord Stream pipeline, citing issues with turbines, delivering only 33 million cubic meters daily, roughly 20 percent of its capacity. What could be Europe's biggest energy crisis in a generation has already prompted German regulators to advise that the bloc's largest economy must cut its natural gas use by 20 percent to protect themselves against any further supply cuts by Russia.